Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Rage 2 with me, Bring It Dawn. Got some exploring to do. Destination reached. It's not like he's saying it's nice to meet me. It's like, nice to meet you! Alright, help me out, turrets. Oh, they already destroyed it. Alright, fine. Destroy your nest then. Chill out. I wasn't going for all the uh, storage containers already, but I'll, I'll take it. Uh, let's go and grab the shotgun. Come on. So I took out the. Uh, birthing pods that were in here. Four more, right? There we go. Thank goodness I wasn't hunting for just the same one for ten minutes. That would be embarrassing. I don't know anything about that. This guy has some amazing reflexes. I just came barreling around the corner. They still managed to dodge me. We're here, Spork. Alright, well, we can take the road. Fallen Ranger, and three storage containers. Do I hear that? Because I hear it. It's probably gonna electrify all the water, isn't it? Let me back up, thank you. Ranger Sharif. Personal log 56, Ranger Sharif. Uh, the signs are clear if you have the courage to see them. I spent more time up in the wilds than anyone, uh, reconnoitering. Talking to the salvagers and prospectors. The stories they tell of glimpsed warriors in black armor of hiding from the patrols of cyber enhanced mutants cannot simply be, dis be dismissed as the fantasies of the dim witted. I've seen signs myself, tracks, scorch marks. Make no mistake, the authority is still alive, operating freely, and they must have a base here in the wilds. The resistance was never able to kill the leaders, General Cross in particular. Perhaps their HQ is right here under my feet. 
I'll keep looking, even if Prowley wants me to return to Violin. I need to know. This guy was ready to rock and roll. Turn this off. By this last uh, storage container. Yeah, I was wondering if they're gonna have a hazard in the water. I was hoping they'd be like a unique mutant or something chilling in the water. And then I couldn't touch the water, otherwise it would kill me. I think that would have been fun. All right, there's a sentry up here we'll go take care of. I'm surprised this game doesn't have like a quick view, like where you can like look behind you real quick. Especially with the there's like two or three different types of vehicles that have a uh that they drop mines behind them. That great. Let's uh just gotta stand your ground. Look cool doing it. Yeah, I think I have some uh, project points I can spend. This is the last one I can afford right here. I need 16 more. Alright, there's one right there. Oh, you do not want any of this, bud. Oh, come here. Think you got what it takes to beat me? Okay, well this tree has what it takes. Come here. No, I'm I'm gonna destroy you. You you have this coming. Sucker. Uh, that's all I cared about. Let's get out of here. Not what I meant to do. Alright. right here that I haven't done. 
checking into the clinic. Wait for me. I could have probably made that a little cooler, but it's fine. We, we did okay. Start taking these guys a little more seriously. Oh, what the? Well, that's all the fuel containers. Let's uh, find all the con all the storage containers that we ran by. We found one right there. There was one back this way. Try boosters that I'll never need. No, not this way. I'm sure I've seen it. Maybe not. Let's follow the path back this way. even further away. Oh, there it is. Redwood. Oh, it's another, uh, it's a town. Neat. We're here, Spore. Got achievement, Wasteland Vagabond. Ranger Walker, you have messages waiting. Hi. Serves revitalized juice. Yeah, I'll talk to you. What's up? Uh, yeah. I hope I'm not bothering you much, but if you're as tough as you look, I might have a gig for you. Name's Iris. I'm a prospector. Me and my brother Burn relocate promising finds for scaver crews and sell the claims. Burn sold a bad claim to a scaver boss named Rick. 
Rick wasn't too happy with that. And now Byrne's been missing for days, and I'm getting pretty worried. Sounds like a setup. But I might go take a look. Where is it? It's not far. I'll mark it for you. Thank you. Yeah, where is it at? Alright, cool. We haven't discovered that location yet, so... So two more arc locations. No, that's a storage container. Wait, have I not done these? Oh, these are bounties. I don't care about bounties. Yes, I'm Lola, and this is Dreadwood Market. We ain't got much, but we buy and sell whatever we can. This ain't Wellspring, okay? Truth is, I'd rather be back there. I should have never followed Rick out here. Oh, creeps. Can't stand them. Creeps? What kind are you talking about? We got sack toads, blood bugs, larva leeches, even disgusting peep toms. Yeah, sure. Say hi to All right, we have some weapon things now. Uh, I think the rocket launcher had another upgrade. Uh, yeah, we'll do the hyper cannon next. We'll do rapid fire. Actually, no, let's do charge efficiency instead. Then weapon mastery. Boom. You know what, let's do a uh, magazine capacity for this one, and I guess all we have left is to max out the, well we have one more for the Firestorm Revolver and two more for the Grav Dart Launcher, but I think that's everything. Don't know where you buy the... Global Damage Boost. You look like you could dish out some pain. Where do you buy the... Watch out for hmm. the creeps now. Name's Rick. I run the Trans Am salvage crew. Scabber born and bred. Scrap can make a man rich, if you have the stones to look for it. But muties breed everywhere up here. Plus poison plants and old war tech hazards. Sounds rough. Lately, things have gone from bad to rotten. River Hall crews have moved in on my claims. Their latest attack was bad. They swarmed the Rash River claim to the east. Killed all my guys there. I have an uh, arrangement of mutual support with the top brass in Wellspring. I need a killer like you to retake Rash River. That place is the linchpin of my whole operation. Sounds like your big friends kind of forgot about you, Rick. But sure, I'll take a look. War in the Wilds. Where's that at? All the way over there? Okay. Exciting excavations number three. Entertainment can be hard to come by out here in the wilds. Rumors have reached my ears of the discovery of a casket belonging to the famed singing mutant known only as Trill. They said that her voice was as sweet and true as any human singer. Local Swole Stop owner even gave her a dressing room of sorts, and some of her more devout fans gifted her dresses to wear. The fans are all long gone, but I believe that I did indeed find her tiny grave, containing only a pair of earrings and a soiled dress. The earrings will make a fine addition to my collection. Or you're just grave robbing, but hey. Sure, that's neither here nor there. Swill still kill. Madam, I'd love to supply you with more swamp swill, but there's been a terrible accident at the Thrusome Distillery. Earl Thrusome sent me a message, telling me that his brother Kurt has died. This has slowed down production somewhat, with Kurt being the brother who is overseeing distribution. Between you and me, rumors are that Kurt spent so long around the swill that he tried to spark up a smoke and ended up setting himself alight, right there in the still, in the still room. Only well, his metal teeth survived. Fortunately, the still is intact.
Is it not up here? Weasel Underwood. What a name. Alright. Is it below me? No, I think it's I think it's up here. Hey, here it is. Message to all Trans Am salvage employees. Salvage team three was reported missing in that area last night. Yeah, the whole damn team. And not just one, but two ugly crushers were spotted. Rick out. I think that was the D and D's hood he's talking about, where he took out the two crushers. Yes, we got stuck in not long ago. There it is. Send reinforcements. Rick, this is the third gosh darn letter I write you. Are you illiterate or just brain dead? We need reinforcements to hold Trunk Town, and we need them now. Stop messing around in Dreadwood and come down here and give me a hand. I don't see anyone else to talk to. So we've cleared this player this area out pretty good. I don't see any more uh radar blips either. So we'll go up here next. Alright. There's also that ecopod we never got to, which is probably right there. Let's take care of this first. We'll probably have another good episode or two exploring to go and then uh probably finish up the game after that maybe three if i find any other locations uh that i haven't discovered yet well, there's some pretty big dead zones like this whole area here that's gotta be something and then uh which i'm assuming it's just another racetrack and then i still don't think i ever found the eco pot there's this here this might be a location that i never found um, there's this as well. So I don't think I ever found an ecopod in one of the areas. I might not have an ecopod, so. Just going through the center. Destination reached. Tower. Prospector searching for good scrap claims. Rick Trans Am told me this place had potential, so I went to check it out. Did he know about the muties? <sighs> Who could tell? Rick's a pretty shifty guy. You seem all right, which is a bit surprising, considering. I don't know why, but the muties never attacked. Stop me from leaving, though. Not sure why. Almost like they tried to warn me about something. I guess I'll never know why. Thanks, stranger. I'll find my own way back to Dreadwood.
Yeah, why would the mutants try to warn him? chest is at. So it could be up top. Oh, all the way up top. Hey, you're welcome, buddy. Alright, I guess the next would be Oh, this is Greenhaven Lookout. Not the Greenhaven uh, Arc. Let's see you back on the main road. Woohoo! <laughs> There's something back here. up on the bridge or is it up there hmm another signal from a ranger suit up ahead Two arc chests and four storage containers. Let's see, that's a sign of mutants. Let's grab this. Actually, you know what? Let's play with the uh, hyper cannon for a bit. It's not that exciting. Oh, wrong weapon. <laughs> All right, hold on. I think it's like all dusty in here. Yay, my nanotri boosters. Glad I have more of those. No, there's something else in here. There it is. It just blends in very well. Double check back over here. All right, no, nothing. Yeah, you'll think twice about that next time. Saw another one over here. Let's 
mesquite shooting. Which is fun. If you haven't done it, I recommend it. If you like shooting. It's definitely a... Hobby to get into. That's pretty fun. Oh, it's first not one shot, one kill I've had in quite some time. Ranger Hawkins, what happened? Recon mission 39.6, Ranger Hawkins. We lost contact with Ranger Sharif. Uh, Prowley and I were forced to give up on finding him. I was sent to check up on Greenhaven instead. It's sad to see it, just think. Not long ago, Greenhaven was just another enclave, just like Vineland, teeming with life, science, and hope for a new future. There are fools, of course, too open, too soft, allowing anyone in and without enough focus on security. Still, they fought valiantly against the Abaddon Muti Horde, but not even Rain could have saved them. What use is Valor for the dead? We're the keepers of their memories now. I wonder if there are more Enclaves out there. Not unlikely. Until we make contact with them, Violin will stand proud as the keepers of the Enclave legacy. Alright, double check, make sure we finish this area. All done. I never actually tried to measure it out. It looks like you dash 10 meters when you dash. Something like that. Alright. And head over there. See what wait what's waiting for us. There we go. What awaits? Onward. <laughs> Don't mind me, guys. Just tearing through your town. I gotta know what piece of that one. <laughs> it landed over here. What was that? It was that. It was his head. I think that was his head.
some life glands. Just run there. Unless it's up there on the uh, the bridge, which is where I think it's at. Which case we will uh make the drive there in style. Baby. Jeez Louise. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how to get out of here. Is it here? Is the way out? No. I'm sorry, buffalo or bison, whatever you are. My guy's pretty good at jumping up cliffs, but I don't think he can do a straight wall like this. Yeah, no, it's not gonna work. Okay, so I should have left my car behind. I understand that now. How the heck do I get out of here? If I just fast travel, just fast travel, easy peasy. How's the go? Modern problems require modern solutions. Teleport out. Easy. Never get stuck again. Icarus may have been able to fly me out of that, that hole, but oh well. Oh, went the wrong way. That's what happened. He tried to ram me. Oh well. Destination reached. Give me ammunition, I feel like it's be a hostile place up ahead. Well, there could be a town. The Huntsman.
I'm not sure what I just climbed up, but I'll take it. All right. I got it. <laughs> oh, my guns do so much damage right now. Uh, let's get to get the uh, authority sentry. It'll probably be time to call an episode. Another authority sentry. We're here, Stork. I don't want to toot my own horn or anything, but, uh, toot. I mean, it, it's, it's the weapon. I have the weapon to thank for my, uh, glaring success. Ah, oh, so I have a handful of things to do. Uh, let's go check out this area and then I'll call it an episode. I'm assuming it's not a bandit camp beside all the other bandit camps. Or dens, or whatever they're called. So we knock it out real quick and call it an episode. It's probably like an area has like two or three storage containers. If I had to guess. Get out of the way, Art. All right, you win this round. Signal from a ranger suit up ahead. Another ranger suit, see? Reached. Arc chest, four storage containers. Well, that was neat. How many mods did I get there? All right. Let's go grab all these storage containers and get out of here. Well, and the uh. The ranger suit, of course. Or the ranger. 
their last words. way back out. Did I miss the, uh... I did. I missed the ranger suit. Right there. Uh, oh no, I'm seeing right now the uh Feltra. Is the Feltra up here? So where is the Ranger. Uh-oh. Oh, there he is. Ranger Baker. Half of him, anyway. Ranger Baker. Well, I'm really lost in these darn tunnels now. I don't quite know where I am. I started somewhere near the wilds. Normally I would have used the ranger suit's internal guiding systems to get me out, but it was damaged when I fell down the shaft. Not that I'm complaining. Better break the nav system than my skull. Flashlight's gone too. So if I don't run to anything nasty down here, I fall down another shaft. I see light ahead. What is that noise? Crap. That sounds like Abaddon Muties chanting something. A name. Gank? Maybe I can wait them out. And he could not. Alright. Well... That was fun. Alright, and I'm going to call it here. Uh, the next episode, we'll start knocking out some of these uh, bandit dens. Working our way southward. That's probably a location there. I feel like the bounties do reveal some locations. But some of them are also just uh, unmarked locations, like on the side of the road or whatever. So they're not that big of a deal. What is this? So this is the base, isn't it? Inside the authority headquarters, but what is this then? Doesn't tell me what it is. All right, regardless, I'm gonna call it here. Uh, next episode, we'll do some more exploring and uh, work our way towards the end of the game. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one.